Uh oh. Launch in three, two, one. Uh oh. Well, that's not good. That's the way to start. We're already dead. Oh, well, never mind. We're not dead. We're just on fire. Everything is totally not fine. We're on fire. Pick up and use. Oh. Alright, we're fine. We're no longer on fire. You have suffered minor head trauma. This is considered an optimal outcome. This PDA has now rebooted in emergency mode with one directive to keep you alive on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. Okay. Just have to close PDA. Alright. Uh. Alright, looks like I need a repair tool to fix some of this. Oh, a med kit. I will actually use that right off the bat. There we go, we're at full health. Alright. Um, welcome everybody to Subnautica! I'm very excited to be playing this game. Alright, I, I need a repair tool. So, how do I... Where is equipment? Uh, tools. To repair tool. Silicon rubber, cave sulfur, and titanium. Okay, that's not too hard. Alright. Let's climb out of here and see what we got. Look at that. Wow. The Aurora suffered orbital hull failure. Cause unknown. Zero human life signs detected. Dive into the water! Achievement unlocked. Get your feet wet. Perfect. Alright. Let's see if we can get some resources and uh, get ourselves started. I'm very excited to be playing this game. I love Subnautica and its underwater adventure. Oh. Copper is an essential component of all powered equipment. Your probability of survival has just increased to unlikely, but plausible. Well, glad to see the PDA is so confident in my ability to survive. That d that makes me feel so much better. <laughs> I don't know what I need. I think I need you. Come here. Alien life forms may have unexpected applications. Uh -huh. Utilizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. Oh, we have something down here. Sea glide fragment. I do know that I need. Uh oh. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. Did it already blow up? No. No, 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 no. Ow. Okay. I see how it is. I do know that I can get cave sulfur from these guys. Grab this. Um, I need more resources. Uh, mostly titanium. I think that's what I mostly need is just titanium. Oh. Give me air bubble. Um, is there any salvage around? I do know I need seaweed, so let me run over here and get some seaweed. I don't know if you know this, but, uh, I'm a little terrified of the ocean. And, uh... Subnautica is basically an underwater game. Oxygen. Yes, I know I need oxygen. But, uh, I, I've seen this game and I've, I've really wanted to play it. Just something a little bit different from playing Minecraft, you know? 
I'm gonna grab this salvage right here. Uh, I don't know if you're hostile. Life on this planet grows in unusually distinct and diverse ecological biomes. Further study. Ow! Okay, you're mean. I I realize that now. I'm gonna leave you alone. Just, just go away. <laughs> um, I want to make the. Let's go ahead and make some titanium. Um, I'm gonna make the uh, the standard O2 tank, so I have a little bit more oxygen in my stuff. Um, okay, so I need silicon rubber. Hello? Oh, it's probably because I don't have the inventory space or something. Um, we'll make a battery with the. Is it because I have no... Oh, because my inventory is full. Um... Oh, I have a storage box in here. Okay. Uh... Well, we don't need that, so I think we'll be fine without it. Um, we'll dump some of that, and I think I'll be fine. Alright, silicon, rubber... Now we can make our... Oh, we can make a better oxygen tank. Oh, but we need silver ore. Um... Alright, well, let's make the repair tool real quick. And let's fix some of the things in here. Lightport secondary systems online. There we go. Environment diagnostic and outputting results to data bank. There we go. Uh, and I think that's pretty much it. I don't think I need the repair tool anymore, but I will probably keep it on me. Let's hope we can find some silver. I want to make the high capacity oxygen. Ooh, scanner. I do know I need that. The scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints from salvage technology and to accord alien biological data. I will make a survival knife. Weapons were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Abraxas Prime. The knife remains the only exception. Alright, let's cook the peeper and the uh, fish. The fabricator cooks small organisms while disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them safe for human consumption. Okay, let's... Let's rearrange this, um, like so. Um, I don't think I need any more of this. Or do I? What do I need? Uh, let's make some glass. Let's put ourselves one step closer to making the oxygen tank. Oh, we need two. Oh, but I need more glass. Uh, let's make some lubricant. Let's just empty out our resources we have. Um, oh, fins! Yeah, that'll make me swim faster. That's perfect. The fabricator draws from available data to provide environment-appropriate equipment using locally available materials. For your safety, this setting cannot be overridden. Well, why would I want to override that setting? That is... that is good enough for now. Uh, let's go back under water. Increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with damage to the Aurora's drive core sustained during planet fall. No, oh, I can't see anything, Captain. I need a I need a flashlight or something. This is Aurora. Distress. Um rescue operation will be dispatched to your location. Oh, I need a battery. Continue to monitor for emergency transmissions from other life pods. Uh, right? Uh, our survivability is very low, apparently. Alright, let's grab a med pack and use it. Since we got blown up earlier. No! I knew you were going to do that, and... You did last time, too. Alright, let's grab 
I don't know if I'll need more cave sulfur, but it's better to get it. In the local cave systems. Oh, sulfur gold. Is an essential component of the repair tool. Oh, I need out of here. I do want to sw explore this cave though, because it could have some of the resources that we need. Alright, back down we go. It had gold in it, so that probably means there's going to be more... Um... Because I think those bigger deposits are... Ooh, there's one. Ooh, lead! Oh, but I need silver! This is probably my best opportunity to find the silver, and then we can make the much better oxygen tank. Ooh, there it is. Oh! Okay, we're nearly dead, so uh, if we run into another one of those, please be silver. Silver-based Yes! Are an essential component of many habitat modules. That's perfect. That is perfect. Alright, um... That is perfect for what we need. Um, is there any... thing in here? Ooh, two more. More lead? Okay. And another silver. That's perfect. Alright. Um, let's get out of here before I drown. Get me out of here, get me out of here, get me out of here, get me out of here. Ow! Okay, yeah. Alright. Yeah, we have <laughs> we have a sliver of health left. Oh my god. <laughs> we nearly died. Um uh, okay. First off, let's take off the oxygen tank. And make Okay, we need glass and titanium, which we should have glass, titanium. And, oh, we need more. One more. High capacity O2 tank. Perfect. Ooh, rebreather. Conserves oxygen when diving deeper. Absorbs and recycles CO2 through breathable air. Um, I think that's... Okay, we need another silver for that. But we also need... Um, we also need... We also need to cut seaweed, I believe, so... Let's cook these. Um, are there any other tools that we can make? The Habitat Builder. That, that's, that's something for much later. We're at, yeah, we're at, <laughs> we're at 3 HP! <laughs> oh no. I need to just stay near base and make a med kit of some sort. There is a cave here, but I'm a little bit terrified um, that I'm going to die if I do anything near it. Uh, let's see about getting seaweed, because I want to make the, uh, the one thing. Um... Oh, here it is. Uh, and let's try and stay away from, uh, those bad creatures that attacked us earlier. Come on, give me a peeper. I need food so I can heal. Okay, let's, uh... Let's get four. That's probably a good amount. Um, let's, let's scan the, um, sea glide fragment. Yeah. Alright, that's one of two. I need one more. So let's make some fiber mesh. And then... 
Um, oh, we can make a first aid kit with that. Okay, that's perfect. Uh, oh, right, we needed another silver so we can make a rebreather so we can stay under water longer. Um, should I save? I mean, we have a health pack. I'm, I'm gonna make another first aid kit. Hopefully it only uses one. Um, yeah, it does. It does. Okay, we're fine. Um, I do need to see about finding some more silver, and hopefully I can find it in here. Uh, more copper. I need to try not to fill my inventory so much at the moment. Um, are there any silver deposits anywhere here? Okay. Oh, no you don't. I'm, I'm not playing that game. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, nothing else in here. That's fine. I see a bladder fish. Give me water! Alright, that's fine. Um, I need to find another sea glide fragment. That, that'd be very helpful for my, my journey. Right, I need the other silver ingot. Where is it? There it is. Uh, make the wiring kit. And make a rebreather. Perfect! And make a titanium ingot. I don't know why we need it, but uh, we probably will. Um, what's the next thing I need to work on? I guess mostly the sea glide. That way we can get around faster. But let's read this message. This is LifePods 3, uploading our coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide, so if we're late for the rendezvous, don't panic. Also, don't go home without us. Seriously. Three out. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Okay. Cool. Um... Okay. Uh, yeah, we can head over there. Ooh, is that a salt deposit? Yes it is, and I see more lead. That is fantastic. Caution. Uh -huh. Continued degradation of the Aurora's drive core may result in a quantum detonation. Continuing to monitor. Uh did that say quantum detonation? So I do know or at least I think I can get some sea glide fragments. No. Hey! Hey! I heard that! Back away! Ooh! Ooh, there is sea glide fragments here. Perfect. Need a blueprint acquired. Um, alright, let's grab this. Need a blueprint acquired. Oh, that's loud. Data. That is... New PDA data. That is very loud. <laughs> Alright. More silver, that's great. Always good to have more silver. Uh, ooh, mobile vehicle bay fragment. One of three. Um, that's another sea glide fragment. I think I get... Titanium? Yeah. More titanium, um... Okay, we'll probably end up finding more mobile vehicle bay parts. Um, I don't think there's any more in this area, I don't think. Ooh, another mobile vehicle bay. I see... What the heck was that? I do see some resources down in that cave. The frick is that? Um, alright. Stop being baby. Stop being a big baby. <laughs> Go! Go get these resources. 
More silver. That's fantastic. No. 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 Ow! 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 I knew that was going to happen. I knew that thing was bad. I couldn't swim away. It wasn't letting me. That was... Terrifying. Okay, there's gotta be... If there's two, there's gotta be three. There's gotta be three somewhere here. I'm terrified. Ooh. Docker tooth. That is useful, actually. I kind of really don't want to go back down in that hole. That that was that was scary. I knew. I knew that thing was bad. All right, the loud noises can stop, please. I'm already terrified as it is. Please be another mobile vehicle bay fragment. It is. Oh yes. Now we're talking. What is this? Propulsion cannon fragment. Um. I don't think I'm supposed to be over in this direction yet. <laughs> Just. I see the deep dark and I'm like, no, thank you. We made it back. We also have the mobile vehicle. Oh, we actually have everything to make this. Um, let's see. Lubricant, this, and titanium ingot. Oh, no, battery. Um, I need more... Do I have an extra battery? No, I don't. I need more mushrooms. Let's make a... let's grab a few, since I know we have a lot of copper. Um, battery, battery, battery. There we go. Um... Oh, we can make the computer chip. Uh, sea glide. The sea glide will increase your effective exploration range. For your safety, please pack supplies for long journeys and stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. Okay, um, so I need a computer chip. Um, upper. Um, so what I'm making now is I'm going to make copper wire, make the computer chip, make a wiring kit, and now we can make the habitat builder! The builder. Is designed to construct habitats mm. capable of withstanding extreme environmental conditions. Perfect. Um, one thing I want to also do is I want to take this, drink some of this water, and make some bleach. Bleach is an essential chemical used for cleaning wounds. And purifying water. Well, I'm just mostly going to use it for water, lady. Preparing the day's water ration ahead of time will help ensure against dehydration and eventual death. Thank you. I, I already kind of figured that much. Alright, uh, we're actually going to take these. We're going to store some of these. I'm going to use this on my health. Drink some water, and we're basically full stats now. And there we go. The mobile vehicle bay fragment is made, even though we don't really have any real use for it yet. But, at least it's made. Um, alright, let's see. Um, let's make another titanium ingot. I, 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 need, I need storage space.
No recipes available. Well, at least we made it. So now we have much more inventory space. This is Ozzy from the cafeteria. What the hell, guys? They didn't want us this might happen. Our pod was almost crushed by the Seamoth Bay on the way down. Now we're hanging on the edge of a cave system, and this grim-looking snake thing's trying to eat through the hull. Come get us already. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Okay, interesting. Um, Habitat Builder. Let's... Oh, okay. We can... We could really start making something out of this. Um, I don't even know where I want to put a base yet. I don't know if I, I, I just want it here. Warning. Local radiation readings suggest the Aurora's drive core has reached critical state. Quantum detonation will occur within two hours. Two hours? Ah, that's too long to wait. Well. Since the Aurora is not going to blow up for about another two hours, I think that's going to be it for today's episode. Hope you all have enjoyed, and if you did, be sure to hit that like button, and also hit that subscribe button if you want to see more. And, uh, yeah. Look forward to seeing more Subnautica in the near future. Anyway guys, that's it. Hope you enjoyed, and have an awesome day. Later! Ready, I'm a blow